I'm Regan Kilkenny, I'm 22 years old and I'm a senior at the University of Connecticut. My name's Anthony, I'm a junior studying digital media and design. The original film club was founded in 2016 with a group of eight UConn students because there was no established film program at UConn. There were film studies classes and film theory classes, but no film production courses that a student could learn start to finish how to make their stories come to life. We've grown to be a tier three organization, a part of UCTV, where we have access to a larger budget where we can buy equipment that our members would actually see out in the field. This also is so helpful because they don't have a film program to supplement their education in a structured way. So being that we now have a budget to give them the equipment they'll actually see, that helps them with the lack of degree in filmmaking, they still get those skills, hard and soft skills to help them. I remember I became DP, director of photography of um, a film my sophomore year, beginning of my sophomore year, and I've that was my first big role in anything, basically. So I had no idea what I was doing, but um, Jacob, the director, was very um, helpful and kind of guided me. And I did have a lot of fun with that. It was very, um, it was a very good learning experience. Now I'm actually directing a film this semester, which is crazy. Through Film Club, if you want to get a film made, you present your idea to the group and every member from the newest freshman to the oldest senior, they have one vote and that counts towards one project that they believe in. So once that's voted on and we decide two to four for a semester, all of the members who weren't involved in the pitching process will be able to join teams and say, hey, I really like this idea. I would love to work on it. Tell me where I can help. So this year, my film was picked, which was very nice. But then you have to write it, which is very long and takes a lot of work. As you're fixing your writing, you have to deal with props, locations, times, actors, casting actors. People don't know how much time and effort pre-production takes. After pre-production, we'll start principal photography. It's, it's a lot of fun, but it's, you know, very stressful as well because you want it to be perfect and you want as much time as possible to make it look good but sometimes that's not the case. It's a great learning experience and it's great to go to a film shoot and just see what it's like. Once you finish production you move on to post-production where you'll do the editing of the actual film, the score, the sound design and once post-production is done you get to release it. You can send it to film festivals if you please. We have a film festival at the end of the semester where we show all of the films from the last year. It's just a great way to come together and see the projects that you didn't necessarily work on and show off the projects that you did. My favorite thing about Film Club, I would say, is definitely um, the people that are in it, just because it's such a fun, inclusive environment. Um, everyone is able to join. You can just walk in and you feel like you're already a family. It's very fun and the people all love to make films so it's just an environment where everyone loves to do the same thing. It's a great way to teach people and help each other just grow which is nice. I think that if there was no film club when I came here as a freshman I probably wouldn't have stayed at UConn. That might sound super dramatic but I didn't necessarily find what I was looking for creatively in my major and this film club has let me shape that and talk to UConn as a whole and say, look how many students want this, look how many people are interested, look how many people want to learn. And I think that's definitely helped tell UConn as a community, hey, this is wanted, and if you make it, we'll be there for it and we'll support it as a student body and then also on a departmental side. I love running film at UCTV, but the people who actually started it, I have the most respect for them because they saw what was missing and they made it happen. And I get to enjoy the benefits of it and see it grow from now on.